I had this scare for a dog. I was like, yeah, I think I want to do something with a trick of light where the lights go out and you can hear this growl in the, in the darkness and the flashlight shines over and you just see the stuffed dog here. And then the light goes off and you start to hear a growl again in the darkness. You know, you come back on, it's still a stuffed dog. And I'm pitching this to James. I'm really excited about it. He's like, oh, that's great. He's like, that's great. What if it's a werewolf? <laughs> and uh, I was like, oh my God, it'd be amazing. So I refer to that as the werewolf situation. I came into the office and, and like, I could hear like, werewolf, werewolf. I'm like, werewolf, were, werewolf? What werewolf? We don't have a werewolf. Again, it's just James thinking so big and he's so great at plussing everything. You learn the hard way that there is a lot of evil in this room. This movie will really allow us the opportunity to introduce other artifacts that we didn't initially come across in the earlier films, such as a haunted wedding gown. And then we get to see a haunted stuff wolf creature, right? When you see that in the movie, you're like, how did, where did the words come across this? Yeah, okay, here we go, pictures up. We both felt very strongly about including the werewolf because it is actually one of the more famous cases that the Warrens have done. So you're looking up, but then you turn because it's coming right at you and you brace yourself and you turn and you scream. To sort of set that table a little bit, just something that we love. <laughs> Great job, McKenna. There's so many types of werewolves out there. It's like, what's going to make it feel fresh and different and new? We went to Justin Rowley at Fractured FX. He's worked with James on a ton of things, Aquaman, and I've worked with him on Swamp Thing. So I hit him up with the idea of the werewolf. He started to do some concept designs, and we started to go back and forth. And after that, Justin got hard at work at designing the head. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, that's good. He and his crew are just some of the most talented bunch of people that I've worked with. <laughs> it's alive. <laughs> and on the last day of shooting, we finally got it. We're very excited by that. In a couple scenes, we have Weta doing some cleanup too, to really help bring it to life. You know, but we really want to lean towards the practical effects of things. So the scene with the werewolf was very interesting. We did like a few different really cool shots. Like breaking the guitar was so much fun for me. I got to break like seven guitars. Action. Ah! I felt like it came out really cool. Yeah. Nice work, everyone.